Well, as we have all heard by now, the North Korean rocket failed to take off and do what it was supposed to do. According to the initial reports that have come out thus far, it failed in its second stage. It was supposed to break off in three stages like rockets normally do, but it failed in the second stage. The second and third did not go off as they were planned. Uh, now, this is the official statement that was given by the North Korean news agency. The DPRK launched its first application satellite, Kwang Meng Yang Sang 3, at the Sohe Satellite Launch Station in Cholsan County, North Fyongan Province, at 7.38.55 a.m. on Friday. The Earth Observation Satellite failed to enter its preset orbit. Scientists, technicians, and experts are now looking into the cause of the failure. Now, even with the disappointing nature of the rocket having failed, some comrades have been quick to jump on what may have caused it. There are some rumors floating around that it was actually shot down by Japan. Now, I don't believe this to be the case. If the rocket had been shot down, North Korea would have known right away. They would have known. They were monitoring it and they saw what stage it failed. They would have seen something hit it. So it would have been really obvious to them. And you know they would have come up with an angry denunciation right away had that been the actual case. So I don't think it was shot down. Now, others have said that it may have been sabotaged. Somebody got in, made it defective, whatever. Um, I sincerely doubt this to be the case. I don't, I don't think that it was done at all. I mean, these things happen a lot. Rockets are very difficult to deal with. Look at how many times rockets had to be tested in the Soviet Union and the United States before the space, the space missions began. Rocket technology is very unstable. It doesn't work 100%. Anybody who's ever watched an episode of Mythbusters knows how difficult it can be. Now, North Korea isn't starting with the, all the knowledge everybody else has. They, they don't have that knowledge from foreign sources. They're literally building their own knowledge on rocket technology from the ground up without any assistance. So, of course, it's like a learning process all over again. So there's going to be a lot of failures because to even think that the first rocket would go up without any problems is it's pretty arrogant. But they seemed fairly confident that it would and they were probably overconfident in that. But this remains, rocket technology is dangerous and it is unstable. In fact, even even making to the second stage it was it's pretty much an accomplishment in itself. But there is one more point I'd like to make. I guess it wasn't actually a missile after all, was it? Missiles don't break apart in three segments and then hit something. They fire and then hit something. So I guess it wasn't actually a missile this whole time like the entire world was screaming it was. Well, and again, it's North Korea. You can just make any kind of claim whatsoever and everyone will believe it. Now maybe they'll look twice the next time they go claiming that a rocket launch is a missile test because they were clearly wrong this time.